Okay, here we are in the 2009 Skoda Octavia 1.8 TSI. This one's the top of the range, Elegance edition. Um, expect lots and lots of gushing from Tim here because he loves this car, but I'm gonna let him explain. I wouldn't say that I love it. I would say the reason why I like it and I think it's good is because you don't notice it. There's nothing you notice that's wrong. Sometimes with cars, they tend to irritate you or they've got little foibles that you don't like. Like some cars now have got um, parking brakes, you know, electronic parking brakes. This has a proper handbrake. Um, the ride is good. You feel comfortable in it. The seats are okay. Yeah. That things aren't, don't feel like they're gonna fall to bits. Don't you think it's a bit dull? It is a little dull. I think that's his, it's, it's only real problem with it. It is a little dull. The, you know, you're not going to go, wow, I've got a Skoda Octavia. But it does the, exactly what you ask of it. It does, it gets you from, from A to B in a nice, sensible, comfortable fashion. It just seems really organised in what it does. Yeah. Um, I'm yeah. beginning to understand you because I didn't really get this car, but the more you drive it, the more it starts growing on you. So it's, it's actually quite quick. This car's yeah. got the 158 brake horsepower, 1.8 turbo. Yeah. You just can't fault it, can you? Yeah, and I think that because it's got that turbo, you do sometimes feel like, because it's got such a lot of low end pull, mm. um, you do feel like you're actually driving a diesel. Yeah, but it's clear it's got the top end yeah. as well, which you uh, lack yeah, in, and in a diesel. So it's good, it's good in the town, it's good on B. It it's feels a, nicely built as well. Like I love the tops of these doors, they're nice and soft and cushioned, you know. Yeah, yeah. Soft there, and then there's little rubber backing to the uh, chrome door door handles. Yeah. It, love it, that, love that stuff. It's just a well put together car, and it's going to be reliable because, because all Skodas are reliable. Mm. Um, they've done one of the customer satisfaction surveys. Yeah. It's our long-term vehicle. We've had it for a while now, yeah. and you know, and for me, it's great because you know, you can carry golf clubs and you can get people in battle out and big drama. Yeah. It just it does. Have, yeah, I suppose it's only criticism. Well, it, we've said it, the only criticism, the other criticism, because we've said it's slightly dull, mm. and it is slightly dull. Um, is it's um, its fuel economy isn't great. Mm. I mean, it says it will do. 40 miles to the gallon. Now, most of the time I've got on the on the clock it's registered uh, 20, 30. I've seen, I've seen 35, yeah. 35 and a half. But um, on our official measurements, when yeah, we've done, you're getting 28 we're, miles we're getting 28, 29, something yeah. like that. So it's not as fuel efficient. But then we we haven't driven. We haven't driven it frugally at all. I've just driven it, we, and we get spent a lot of time coming in town, it just around town. Saps it, yeah. And I just think it's. It's just it's, it's fractionally expensive as well. I mean, I think this one's this one's around about fifteen eight something like that. But we've got uh, metallic paint, we've got um, a roof spoiler, <laughs> and we've got um, uh, alloy wheels. And I think that adds about another eighteen hundred quid on it. Mm. Like maybe 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 a bit less. It's not too bad. It's not doing with the Astra the other day, which cost twenty one grand. And Absolutely, still me. Yeah. Um, That's. A, I mean, this is a bargain compared to that, isn't it? Yeah. Really? So, for just a straightforward piece of two dudes, car buying advice, <laughs> if you've got 18,000 or maybe a bit less because you don't want to buy a roof spoiler and put alloys on and all that gubbins, if you've got about 16 grand to spend, try one of these. Try one of these. Brilliant. It will go. Consumer advice. Great consumer advice, that is.